Hi everyone, welcome to the channel Clarity for Sure. So we have started this current ARD series and today is day 5 of that series and we are discussing some MCQs related to the agriculture and rural development and these MCQs will help you with your NABAD grade A exam. So let's start with today's video. The first question is, which portal was launched at the 8th edition of NPOP event specifically designed to showcase certified organic products and connect the stakeholders with global players? So the name of the portal is Organic Promotion Portal. So the farmers, FPOs and all the exporters, they can register themselves and they can showcase the certified organic products in this portal and get the leads from the global buyers. Next question, which of the following statements regarding the NPOP is incorrect? NPOP has equivalence with organic food regulations of European Union and Switzerland NPOP launched during 2005 laid the foundation for systemic development of organic agriculture sector in the country. Wild area constitutes a significant portion of the total organic cultivation area in India. NPOP is being managed by APIDA under Ministry of Commerce and Industry. All types of agriculture, horticulture and non-food crops are grown under organic certification process. So here the right answer is uh, option B because it is incorrect. NPOP was launched during 2000. One. Next question. Arrange the following commodities in descending order of their export volumes from India as per the data on organic production. So this is based on the data available on IPDA's website and similar kind of question was asked in 2024 phase 1. Uh, so you have to remember uh, the data in this way as well. So the answer to this question is fiber crops are the commodities which has largest export volumes, followed by oil seeds, sugar crops, cereals and millets, and then pulses. So the answer here is 2, 3, 4, 5, 1. So option B is correct. So even if you don't remember all of this, please remember that fiber crops are the at the largest volume. So before we move on to the next question, I would like to tell you that NABAD Mentorship for 2025 has been started and Clarity for Sure provides a comprehensive mentorship program with expert guidance, master notes, live classes, revision quizzes, power play quizzes so that you can be prepared for both phase one and phase two. So you will get descriptive answer writing guidance and interview guidance as well. The fee is nominal considering the immense value you will get. Check out the link in the description to enroll and begin your journey with us and you can also register for a free trial video. Uh, you can also uh, understand how this course is structured uh, by registration. If you have any query, please drop a mail at c4scourses at gmail.com. So let's move forward with the next question. What is the total area under organic certification process registered under NPOP in India as of March 2024? So, the total area under organic certification process is 7.3 million hectares. This uh, area includes both the wild area and the cultivable area as well. Next, which of the following states has the largest area under organic certification as of 23-24? So, the largest area, Madhya Pradesh. And the state uh, which is the largest producer of organic products is Maharashtra. So, here the answer becomes Madhya Pradesh. Next question, which of the following states is not among the top five largest producers of organic products in India as of uh, financial year 24? Maharashtra is the largest producer of organic products as I told you before. Along with Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh, Rajasthan, Karnataka and Gujarat are the top five largest producers of organic products. Odisha is not one of them. So the answer becomes Odisha. So here I have given you the information about the NPOP. So 8th edition of the NPOP has been uh, launched and NPOP was initially launched in 2001. So EPIDA is the implementing agency of this NPOP scheme and it comes under the Ministry of Commerce and Industry. So the 8th edition of NPOP was mainly focused on easing of the operations and simplification of the certification proce procedures and all of that and they also launched new portals like the NPOP portal, organic promotion portal, 
on which we have solved one MCQ. Tracenet 2.0 is also launched and EPIDA portal and EGRI exchange portal were rerun. So this was it for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this class. Thank you so much for watching.